Really, do you think the environments that you've been in, the, you mentioned MIT, the rigor, do you think that's been really a key driver of your success, the, just being around people that are really smart, that you can learn from it, but who also push you? Well, definitely. I think that's, that's, certainly, that's certainly a big aspect to it. And, um, and you know, so like attracts like, you know, I think uh, many of you if, you, if you think back to what made you come to Haverford, my guess is your visit to the campus had something to do with it. And my guess is it was the people you met on the visit here that had something to do with it. And so that's like attracting like, right? And so, um, you know, the, 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 the top institutions in chemistry at the graduate level, mm -hmm. um, you know, there's, there's often a thought, um, some of it fueled by politicians who want their state to have as much money as Massachusetts, they wonder how can Mass why is it that Massachusetts is getting all the money? Well, it's because they have the institutions that have attracted the best people, and so there's a there's a um, a movement. I wouldn't say that it's it's um, you know organized in any way, but it just so happens that people feel well. Those guys at Harvard, those guys at MIT, they don't need the money. They've got plenty of money. That's just not true because there's just so much going on, and so we have to protect. Um, we have to protect the, the really gem institutions. I don't think we should overprotect them by funding the work that isn't worthy. Uh, I remember being on a study section where um, we had to ultimately turn down a very, very uh, distinguished senior scientist from one of the top five chemistry departments, um, you know, just because the, the, and it was like the third time around. Yeah. And, uh, it, nobody felt good about it, but we had to uphold the the uh, the, the rigor of the science and the, and the, yeah. and the thoughts behind it. Yeah. So we ha we need institutions like that, and but we need the other institutions as well because there are people in those other institutions who are just as good as in the best institutions, and they will rise to it, given some time. I've yeah. seen that over and over and over again. I know some really absolutely first-rate scientists, including Nobel Prize winners, who did not start at a high level, but managed to get their self, themselves up there just because they knew. I mean, look what Einstein started with, right? Mm -hmm. He was in the post office. Yeah.